Mrs. Bhuvanswari, BCom. Graduate of Madras University hails from Chennai. Her passion towards art strives her to complete diploma in fine arts at Tamil Nadu Dr. J. Jaya Lalita Music and Fine Arts University, Chennai. She is a trained and authorized art teacher of Dasan Academy. Artists say about the painting, Normally, the world will be mesmerized by Kanan's flute music, but here, Kanan himself is mesmerized by the flute music of Radha. This is the woman power, Ms. Bihima Malini, an arts graduate, hails from Vlore. She is a trained and authorized art teacher of Dasan Academy. She started her career as an art teacher, in the year 2014. She has been training children for about seven years. This is the fifth continuous year, she is exhibiting her artworks. Artists say about the painting, This is my first mural painting. Inspired by the realism with the dramatic sense and hand postures of this art made me take up this special dance painting. Mrs. Lakshmi, BCom, MA, from Madras University. I am qualified teacher of Desan Academy and I conducts classes at Kolator. I have been handling the Kolator branch from the year 2015 in a successful manner and my students participated in various drawing competition and won many prizes. Artists say about the painting, the Radha Krishna painting portray an eternal love that existed between Lord Krishna and Radha. Padma Malini is a native of Nagar Koil, Tamil Nadu who learned to draw as a child from her father. Having a career in IT and still pursuing art under artist Rajendran's guidance has slowly rediscovered her hidden desire to pursue a career in art. She quit IT and started focusing on creating an art style that shows women at their best when they are free to do what they like. An observer of people around her she captures photographs and loves to explore her art style in different media. Artists say about the painting, she is fascinated by the smart brain and shares a kiss. I am Pratima dreamt of exploring myself into art from childhood and now completed PG diploma in fine arts at Desan Academy. During past five years I got an opportunity to exhibit my work in various galleries, I feel so happy for my art being appreciated by the audience. Artists say about the painting, Fire and woman as depicts woman being powerful and assertive, she is fierce and strong and full of fire and that not even she hold her back because her passion burned brighter than her fear. Ms. D. Radhika, M. Tech, graduate worked in a reputed engineering college for a decade. With a passion to become an entrepreneur, she started Children's Castle, an after-school activity center for children. She is very passionate about teaching and arts. Artists say about the painting, unfettered literally means not bound by shackles and chains. This painting depicts the empowerment of women. Today women are strong, powerful and well educated. They face various challenges in life with utmost confidence and are successful in all their endeavors. Shruti Kamka is a professionally established artist, illustrator and painter with 10 years of experience in the field. She studied BFA in Bharatiya University, Coimbatore, BB a graduate in MOP Vaishnav College, then faculty in Desan Academy. The artist has displayed her work at international and national levels. Few of them include international and national art exhibition in 2017 to 2019, Shades of Soul in 2017 to 2019. The artist enumerates passion in fluid art, knife painting and also does art involving mixed media, mixing of two forms of mediums to create new art. Passionate towards drawing and painting from an early age I graduated in visual communication and now I am pursuing bachelor's degree in fine arts at Desan Academy Chennai. With experience as graphic designer and painting artist I stepped into teaching with an idea to share the knowledge I gained from my masters. I will hopefully succeed in transforming the thoughts and ideas of the young generation into vibrant hues. Artists say about the painting, it's an abstract artwork splash of colors using palette knife. Sudha Rajendran, born 1989 and growing up in Andaman, Sudha Rajendran has developed a deep sense of kinship with the artistic nature of the birthplace around her. Painting however has been a medium of language to convey her thoughts with color. Sudha Rajendran likes to paint realistic subjects with a creative edge of imagination that captures the sight of onlookers. Her bold rich palette of colors and her strong sense of creation lets her produce unique pieces of art with a personal touch. Her interest revolves around common subjects with a contrasting touch to realism. Artists say about the painting, this painting depicts the curiosity of a bride in her married life. The eyes show her love and longingness for a blissful life. She is eagerly waiting to fulfill her role of a doting wife and a mother. Sadhava Sudevan is a diploma and fine artist graduate. 
She also a Montessori child educator who worked in schools for six years. Whether it's through painting or teaching she see it in a unique eye-opening way as it gives opportunity to learn and be creative. She has conducted different exhibitions and students of her branch have won several prizes in different competitions. Artists say about the painting, Janu Devar and Sachibadi couple's son Pundarigan. He was a man of great respect and devotion to his parents. Intending to show Pundarigan who was serving his parents, he stood at the gate of Pundarigan home and asked for water. It was raining and muddy there. So Pundarigan threw a brick from inside. Stand on top of it for a while I will finish the work for my parents and take care of you. Accordingly, Pundarigan ended his parental service and welcomed them. Rukmini, who could not bear it anymore, broke down by saying came that's Krishna. Krishna smiled. In the service of your mother and father the mind said amused. I am fascinated with art from my school days which led me to become an artist. To fulfill my dream. I'm doing BFA and in final year now. Artists say about the painting, my small tribute to our ancestors, who gave amazing sculptures which symbolizes the cultural heritage of India. I depicted my inspirations from them with a blend of abstract, semi-realistic and an engraved painting on canvas. Although a graduate in mathematics, my passion has always been in art since childhood. More than just being in art, painting takes me to my happy place which comforts and rejuvenates my soul. I find my inner peace in painting. Artists say about the painting, this is a painting of Lord Ganesha, one of the most worshipped deities of the Hindu religion. I personally chose this painting to try out the intricate detailing of the stone statue effect and the foggy appearance in the front. I am Catherine Nishant, an artist, completed my PG degree and was working as a lecturer. Later out of my passion for drawing. I completed my diploma in fine arts at Tamil Nadu Dr. J. Jayalalita Music and Fine Arts University, Chennai. As an artist I am based in my realistic work on spiritual search of thousand year civilization for going out to other dimensions. Artists say about the painting. She is full of wounds riddled with scars but she is still standing and she is still beautiful. I always loved to draw and paint from my young age but didn't have the opportunity to do. Now only I started learning and painting. This is my fifth painting. Artists say about the painting, I always choose Buddha to paint on my canvas. I like Buddha pictures a lot so I chose one this time too. Vatsala was born in 1972. She started her drawing passion in Rangoli. When her life turned upside down after demise of her husband her passion turned to profession. With motivation of self she wanted to pursue her life as a drawing teacher. With her guidance from her center head she started her own franchise almost after 10 years she is running successfully she is famed for her patience and teaching skill her speciality be pastel and acrylic painting. Artists say about the painting, I would like to explore new methods and techniques in painting, and that's the main reason I chose this method of painting. Sand painting is the art of pouring colored sands, and powdered pigments from minerals or crystals or pigments from other natural or synthetic sources onto a surface to make a fixed or unfixed sand painting. Unfixed sand paintings have a long established cultural history in numerous social groupings around the globe, and are often temporary, ritual paintings prepared for religious or healing ceremonies. This form of art is also referred to as dry painting. Out of the passion towards the art, I love to learn and teach art in unique way. I capture the very essence of each subject in a simple sensual compelling way. Also, I love to show the power and beauty of feminine in my portraits. L love to work in all medium. Has a deep passion over color pencil. Artists say about the painting, this painting depicts the gracious charming lady with the pot and the cute deers. The highlight of the painting is lightning, charming beauty of the lady and the deer I love to use whole range of colors and glorious lightning effect. This painting fills the thirst of the eye and it provides a feast to art lovers. I enjoy thick glossy bold colors and my favorite subject is nature with portrait. Vishnu Lakshmi has interest in art from childhood, and joined art classes conducted by Mr. Karthik and then learned even more about drawing and paintings with Mr. Rajendran. And completed diploma in fine arts with her master guidance. Artists say about the painting, it is a type of Indian classical dance painting Bharatnatyam. Director of Rikshay Academy, passionate towards drawing, singing and teaching. Artists say about the painting. The painting is beautiful village girl, 